This new method to start YouTube automation will literally blow your mind because it will let you create monetizable, faceless YouTube videos with just a simple text prompt without you ever having to show your face or edit your videos. It's the start of 2024 and getting started with YouTube automation has never been easier thanks to AI. And if you're wondering whether automated channels can be monetized, check out this one. All of their videos are faceless space exploration videos and they make close to $10,000 per month. So yeah, as long as your videos are valuable, original, non-repetitious and use non-copyrighted materials, you can easily monetize your videos. But most channels that start with YouTube automation fail because of three main reasons. They either pick the wrong niche or they don't use the right tools, which in turn lead to failure and they don't remain consistent enough. You will need to consistently create two to three videos every week for at least four to six months before you hit monetization for an automated channel. And that's not going to happen unless you overcome these three barriers. That's why in today's video, I will take you through the exact step-by-step -step process that you need to take to create and monetize a brand new faceless YouTube automation channel. And not just that, but if you stick around till the end, I will also share my top tips on growing your channel super fast. So hit that subscribe button and let's get started. The first step here is finding the right niche for your videos. This should ideally be based on four parameters. Your interest or the evergreen overarching niche you want to target. What's trending right now? What stands to make you the most amount of money once monetized? And how easy is it to create videos in? Anything that lies at the intersection of these four can help you sustainably create content consistently and achieve good growth quickly. But to make it easier for you, here's a list of the top trending niches for YouTube automation that will increase your chances of growing your channel quickly and easily in 2024. To narrow it down further, you can research on YouTube for topics in your niche. And after researching for a good hour, I can see that true crime videos tend to do really well both for long and short form content. And there are several channels here gaining millions of views and thousands of followers in this niche. Let me show you an example video. Tsinghua University students, poised to showcase their talent that evening, faced immense pressure. One student, Zhu Ling, was confronting an especially daunting challenge. She was about to deliver a six-minute solo, poised to be the defining six minutes of her life. Now, the beauty is that these videos are super easy to create because they just need a good narration and relevant B-roll. Plus, you never have to be in front of the camera, so it's checking all my boxes. So this is the niche that I'm going to go ahead with for this video. Next, we need to find ideas for our videos, which is not difficult to do for a true crime channel at all. True crime is a massive subgenre on the internet and you will find thousands of resources covering them right from Reddit stories to YouTube videos and even popular platforms like Netflix. I would suggest searching on YouTube for popular true crime stories and looking at cases that have done well globally. Keep in mind that when you search on YouTube, it will show you results according to your particular location. But if you want to create content for a global audience, you can use a VPN to search for topics on YouTube to get results from across the world. And this will give you a better idea of the broad reach of the topic that you're covering. For this video, I can see that the case of Isabella Guzman did very well since her case went viral in 2023. It got a lot of traction on TikTok and even YouTube. So that is the idea that we'll be working on for this video. Next, we get down to actually making the video. And this is going to be done entirely using AI. There are quite a few tools that you can use here, but the easiest one that I have found that can literally give you a published ready YouTube video with just a simple text prompt without you ever having to edit your videos is in video AI. What's more is that all the footage it gets for you, the music and the voiceover is 100% royalty free, so we can ensure that your videos will be monetized. So I signed up for an account on ai.invideo.io and this brought me to this prompt box where all you have to do is give it a prompt. And the magic actually lies here. How well you prompt it will determine the quality of your video and I'm going to share my template with you in the description so you can duplicate it and use it for whatever topic that you're creating on. Now let's go ahead and click on this drop down on the top right and choose YouTube Explainer as the workflow. This just makes it a lot easier to engineer our prompt because we just need to fill in the blanks. The first thing we need to do is select the duration. I want it to be about 10 minutes long. Next, we need to write our topic in detail. Make a video on the story of Isabella Guzman. Now, since the first 30 seconds of a YouTube video are extremely important, we want it to have an impactful intro that is attention grabbing and starts with a bold statement. After that, I'm going to give it instructions on what the video should include. Talk about what the girl did, details of the case, the life of Isabella Guzman, where she is now and what the verdict is. Next, we want to give it inputs on language and structure. Keep the language dramatic but colloquial. The overall mood of the video should be dark and creepy. 
the pacing needs to be suspenseful and the aim of the video is to hook the audience and give them the full story. Now, one of the best parts about this tool is that you can give it an article link and ask it to pick information from there. I have this article that goes in depth about the story of Isabella Guzman. So I'm going to copy the link and then prompt the AI to pick information from here. I also want to give it instructions on the tone of voiceover, make the voiceover dynamic and persuasive and have a casual word style. Now let's give the tool direction for what kind of music we want. We want dark and suspenseful music. We didn't write the language and the gender of the voiceover because we can do that from the drop down here. Let's go ahead and select an American female voice. And now we are going to let the rest of the parameters stay the same and click on continue. So with this prompt, we've basically told the AI what the hook should be, what you want the video to cover, what the language and structure should be, what the overall mood of the video should be, what the pacing should be, the type of voiceover music we want, and the article we want to base the content on. Now, when you click on generate, InVideo AI will ask you for a few more details, such as the target audience you want and the look and feel you want for the video based on your prompt. Select those, and then once you click on continue after choosing, InVideo will create your first draft in just a few minutes. Let's take a look at the first draft. Imagine a quiet suburban neighborhood disrupted by an act so horrific, it would send chills down the spine of even the most hardened true crime enthusiast. Incredible! In just 10 minutes, the AI basically wrote a full-fledged script for a 10-minute video, chose hyper-relevant stock clips from its stock library of over 8 million such assets, added a very realistic human-sounding voiceover, added a great soundtrack, added text styles and transitions, and cut the video and edited it in sync with the voiceover and music to make it publish ready. Now, once the first draft is generated, you can go ahead and make any changes you want to the video by using this command box. I, for instance, want to change the voiceover to a British male because I think that will have more gravitas. This voiceover is not really doing the trick. Now, let's take a look. The one person in the world who is supposed to love you unconditionally. Super cool, right? Next, I want to change the music to be more dark and somber. The story starts with a troubled past. Doesn't that sound so much better? And finally, I want to add subtitles as well. Now, with that, our video is ready. In case you give it a prompt and you don't like the results, you can always press this undo arrow and go back to the previous version and try again. And in case you want to make specific changes to the video, like changing a part of the script or changing a particular clip, you can use this edit option right below the canvas to do so. Now, for a true crime video like this one, you will need to add a few clips or photos related to the actual crime. So in this case, we want to add images of Isabella Guzman itself as well as uh, recordings from her case proceedings. And you can simply do these by downloading these clips from YouTube. Make sure you turn on the Creative Commons filter to ensure that the footage that you're using is copyright free. And then use a website like this one to download the YouTube video itself. Once it's downloaded, simply click on this upload option within the InVideo editor to upload these clips. And once they're uploaded, simply select the clip that you want to replace from the timeline above and then click on your chosen clip. And then you will see that it gets placed on top of the original, meaning that it has been replaced. Apart from that, if you want to make any changes to the script, you can click on this edit script option and make the edits you want. I'm just going to tweak the intro slightly and make a few changes to the outro to make it more crisp. And that looks so much better. Then simply click on apply. And with that, our video is done. I'm going to share a link to the full video in the description. But for now, let's preview the initial bit. Who is Isabella Guzman? Imagine a quiet neighborhood disrupted by an act so horrific, it would send chills down the spine of even the most hardened true crime enthusiast. In the heart of the peaceful town of Aurora, Colorado, within the four walls of an ordinary home, a heinous crime was about to unfold. The perpetrator? A young woman named Isabella Guzman. This is not a tale of a hardened criminal, a seasoned offender, or a cold-blooded psychopath. This is the story of an 18-year-old girl whose life took a dark and chilling turn. Doesn't that look great? Now, once your video is ready, you need to go set up a new YouTube channel. Use ChatGPT to come up with name ideas and a description. This is what we are going with. Then you can use the DALI plugin in the GPT store to create a profile picture and banner image for your channel as well. This is what ours looks like. And finally, you want to create your thumbnail for the video. For this, go to Explore GPT section in ChatGPT and search for 
thumbnail maker by Inverio. Here prompt the AI to generate a thumbnail for you by giving it details for your video. Once you click enter, the InVideo plugin will generate a description of the thumbnail for you and ask you if you would like to go ahead with it. I like the description, so I'm going to say yes. The thumbnail maker will then create the thumbnail for you in a matter of minutes. You can give it additional prompts to make any changes you want and then come up with a gorgeous thumbnail that does the job. After that, all that's left to do is export your video from InVideo. Just go ahead and export and choose your parameters. The free plan gives you a 720p output with a watermark. So I would suggest upgrading to a paid plan if you want to do this consistently because it just starts at $20 a month. And once your video is exported, upload it to your channel with the thumbnail and hit publish. Ideally, you should have a bank of four to five such videos ready before you start publishing so that you can maintain consistency. But that is just one piece of the puzzle. Now that you've set up your channel and started creating content, let's look at how you can grow it quickly and monetize it. The first way to do this is to pick the right topics, which we have already covered in detail in the video earlier. Stick to creating videos and topics that have already gone viral. The second thing you want to do is focus on the packaging of your video, which is creating a very clickworthy thumbnail and picking the right title. Again, you can do this by researching what kind of titles and thumbnails are getting maximum traction and trying to replicate those in your own style. You will also need to do a little bit of SEO research to incorporate important keywords in your title and description so that your videos can be found during search. The third thing you need to do, and this is perhaps the most important for fast growth, is to create and publish shorts regularly. Shorts are being pushed massively by the YouTube algorithm in 2024, and they are the easiest way to gain visibility on the platform. Creating an audience is much easier to do on short form content. And this automatically gives a push to your longer videos as well, which are important from a monetization perspective. We created a shorts channel using InVideo AI and garnered 17,000 views in just four videos. Check out that video here. Finally, you want to avoid falling for that trap of a get rich quick idea. Even with the right AI tools, the YouTube algorithm requires you to be consistent with your posting and providing value to your audience. So if you're getting into the YouTube automation game, make sure you're giving it enough time to show results. This could be sudden depending on your topic or niche, or it could take a few months. But regardless, once you do get monetized, there is no cap on the amount of money you can make especially by also incorporating other money-making avenues. So go ahead, use InVideo to create and regularly publish YouTube videos to grow your faceless channel. And don't forget to check out this video next to find out the 24 best faceless YouTube niches that will make you money in 2024.